Hello and welcome back to Nicole's DIY. I hope you're all doing well. Today I'm participating in Dina Tollefson's Insect Art Challenge. So first I practice on a piece of paper drawing a simple butterfly. And then I'm going to draw one right here on my small canvas. For me the wings were like drawing small flower petals. Okay friends, this is really for beginners. This is a beginner drawing and a beginner painting. To create a background, I'm gonna use titanium white and the permanent black. I'm gonna take this tinfoil, wad it up, and use this for blotting. Just to give a background to the butterfly, make it stand out. You can use any color, or a different technique if you choose. If you are new to my channel and want to say hello and welcome in, I hope you enjoy this video and you would give me a thumbs up. And to my returning subscribers and friends and family, thank y'all so much for your continual support and encouragement. I really enjoy speaking with all of you. For the butterfly wings, I'm using Ocean Green by Master's Touch. I am also using the permanent black to outline the wings to make them pop. And because we see so many beautiful butterflies that are so detailed and just gorgeous. Thank you, Dina, for having this art challenge. It really does challenge me because I've never painted a butterfly. You bring out the creativity in all of us. Please visit Dina Tullison's channel. She will have a playlist of all the creators who participated, and I know you'll be so blessed by it. They are very talented. If you have never painted before and you want to, you're not sure where to start, I would go on to YouTube, type in painting for beginners, whatever the subject is, and you will find it. There are so many wonderful, talented creators who are willing to share their information, their knowledge with you. For this butterfly painting, my inspiration was YouTube. Thank you to all the artists who shared your knowledge of how to paint a butterfly. I hope this video is encouraging you to paint. Try something new, different that you haven't done before. That's what I'm doing. I 
as I'm painting this beautiful butterfly, I am thinking of the transformation that we all can go through and experience like this beautiful butterfly. Romans 12, 2. And do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. So I encourage y'all to spend some time in the Word of God, get to know our Creator. Jeremiah 29 11, for I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you a future and a hope. Friends, that scripture changed my life when I found out that my Father God in heaven, creator of heaven and earth, had plans for my life. See, we're always planning for ourselves. But God has a plan, a perfect plan. And when I found that out, it just totally transformed my life. And so I hope and I encourage you to read the Word of God, the Bible. Get to know your Father in Heaven. And we can have a relationship with Him through His Son, Jesus Christ. John 3 16 for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life many of you, when you were younger, or even now, you go out to the yard into the garden and the butterflies will land on you? Oh my goodness, that is just the neatest thing ever. That happened to me quite often when I was younger. Not so much now, but when I was a child, I just thought that was so cool. I'm taking this glitter pen. It's silver, it's light, and it will give it a little shimmer and soften it up. I want to share with you the reason why I showed you a drawing in the beginning of the video was because for the longest time I did not know how many of these artists could just put all that beauty on their canvas and many of them do without drawing on the canvas first but there are quite a few that show the drawing on the canvas so I hope that encourages you and answers any of those questions as to why I did that.
thank you for spending time with me and watching this video. Please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Alright y'all, until next time, be blessed.